What's up, YouTubers? Johnny DIY here. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to fix your window that won't stay up or open. We're going to be specifically changing out the window spiral balances. If you guys are new to my channel, please do me a favor. Click the subscribe and the little notification bell so you can get all my new videos. So ditch that old stick that you've been using to prop up your window and let's fix it. Okay, so first thing you're going to want to do is remove any window blinds or curtains that you have installed above the window because those are going to get in the way of us putting in the new balances. Now on either side of the window, the balance is right here. There's usually these little stop blocks at the top. You just pry them off. Sometimes they're screwed in, just usually one screw. Open the window up and we're going to want to prop it with either a stick or you can go ahead and clamp the side to hold it up. Okay, now you're going to want to get one of these. This is a spiral balance charging tool. I'll put a link down in the description to some. Now they have different heads on the top depending on the kind of spiral balance you have, but we'll get more to that later. So I'll just show you guys doing one, but you're going to want to do these in pairs. Now it's kind of hard to see, but on each side, right under here underneath the weather stripping is where those spiral balances attach. Sometimes they're mounted with one screw, but a lot of times they're just hooked on there. So we take our charging tool and we're going to try and hook it pull this balance down there we go we'll hook it onto the balance then we can pull it down all the way okay looks like this one's completely busted but usually you're just going to want to pull it down a little and you're going to want to turn it counterclockwise that's going to relieve the tension in the spring then up at the top there's one little bolt holding it on so we'll just go ahead and loosen up that quarter inch bolt with our ratchet take that out all the way then we'll go ahead and lower the window back down. Then we can grab that old balance. We're just going to pull it right up out of the window. Okay, now here's our new one. And how you measure the old ones to order them, you just measure the tube portion, the length, and then the diameter. And then the bottoms are going to be different. Like I was telling you about the tools are different. You're going to want to make sure you match up the bracket on the bottom. Sometimes they just have a little rod. Sometimes they have one like this, a little hook style. But just make sure you order the right ones. Then with the clip side down, we're going to go ahead and slide it back in that channel. Slide it all the way down. Make sure our clip gets down at the bottom. Then we can go ahead and tighten down that little quarter inch screw. Holds the whole window balance in. Make sure that's good and snug down. Okay, so now we'll take the bottom of our balance and you just kind of push it up and it'll spin. And we'll push it all the way up till it gets to the bottom of the window sash. Now if you look close, there's a little hole right on the bottom of the balance. We'll take our spiral balance tool and the end of it is gonna hook right into that hole. You just grab onto it like that. And you're going to turn it clockwise. Turn it until we get some tension. I like to tension it a little so it's right there at the bottom. And then what you're going to do is you're going to want to turn it. Start off with five times. Five. Then we slowly raise it up. And that hook, it just wiggled a little until it snaps in. There we go. It just hooks right there onto the bottom. Okay, now we can go ahead and remove our stick. And when you replace the second one, you're going to want to spin it the same amount of times. So five times on this side as well. So we just want to tension the window enough so that it doesn't fall down on its own. If it ever starts to fall on its own, all you have to do is pull that balance with your little tool. Give it a couple more turns on each side and you'll be good to go. And then lastly, don't forget to put those safety stops back up at the top. Those just prevent the window from overextending and damaging those spiral balances. All right, guys, and that is how to replace your spiral window balances. This isn't the hardest job, but it can be a little fiddly, so make sure you do have some patience with you. And if you guys are new to my channel, do me a favor, click the subscribe and the notification bell so you can get all my new videos. Thanks for watching Johnny DIY. Give the video a thumbs up, too. All right, guys, take care and keep on doing it yourself.